Derivation of axial electric field in traveling wave tube. TWT the working bar no RF signal helix structure like apply chain. As a result, your RF signal axial electric field to generate in the one. Again, electron beam travel in electron beam is the slow wave structure like electric field induce. So here and the field add up either circuit power increase. So, this is the working amplification. Now, that is the derivation. So, for that, we are considering slow wave helix structure as a distributed lossless transmission line. The figure is the slow wave structure, transmission line. It is considered the electron beam and the dotted lines. So, this is the first line. So once you transmission line electron beam thamala interact with the electron beam or current transmission line like induce. So electron beam transmission line like induce in a current on dou i by dou z into d z minus dou i by dou z into d z. In the middle of the derivation of the transmission line, the particular section mathrana consider here, which is denoted as d z. So d z like entry in the current i on d z in the exit in the current in the right i plus dou i by dou z into d z. So three and four figure consider here. That is the point that voltage in the right that v plus dou v by dou z into d z. Now, we have a section of the section of the section. So, we have a section of the section. We have a section of the section of the KVL and KCL. So, using KCL, KCL apply chamber, you will be getting as dou i by dou z is equal to KCL in the capacitor across on a principle equal to minus C into dou v by dou t minus dou i by dou z. So, this is the first equation. इधर उन द कैपेसिटर में क्रॉस हो रहा है ना वोल्टेज माइनस डो आई बाय डो इसे नो वाले ना और एक्स्ट्रा टर्म नो वाले ना द एक करंट बूढ़ी अपडे इंड्यूस ही इलेक्ट्रॉन इलेक्ट्रॉन बीम इलेक्ट्रॉन बीम कारण हम एक करंट ये रे लूप लेके इंड्यूस आगो आ एक करंट है ना माइनस डो आई बाय डो इसे in the z direction, the field propagates in the axial electric field in the z direction. Do by do z is equal to minus gamma and do by do t is equal to j omega. Assume j do by do z and do by do t is minus omega and j omega. It forms the equation number 3 and equation number 4. So, here you have equation number 3 in your full name, equation 1 in and 2 in and substitute here. Or dou by dou z, dou by dou t in and value will be substitute here. Then, you will be getting as minus gamma i is equal to minus j omega cv plus gamma i. Fourth equation and fifth equation is minus gamma v is equal to minus j omega l i. Then, equation 4 in and equation 4 in and i in the value calculate here. So, i is equal to j omega cb minus gamma i divided by gamma. So, here i in the value equation number 5 will substitute here. And then our equation that is minus gamma v is equal to minus j omega l into ipa namal kandu vidicu current in the value. Value it would go then bracket open j here. LHS लेके गामा वैल्यू उड़ेगा, so you are getting the final equation as गामा गामा स्क्वायर v is equal to minus v omega square lc minus गामा i j omega l. नार्मल के कितना इक्वेशन नंबर सेवन चाहिए होगा। now इधर लम करंट और लम कंडीशन लर्न, now करंट जीरो आने के इलेक्ट्रॉन बी में करंट अंदर इंड्यूस ऐ नहीं लाने के I इक्वल टू जीरो सो आ इक्वेशन नंबर सेवेन ला I इंड I के जीरो सब्सटिट्यूट ऐ नो यू बी गेटिंग एस गामा नोट स्क्वायर इस इक्वल टू माइनस ओमेगा स्क्वायर एलसी I जीरो आइटलाइन अंदर गामा नोट स्क्वायर इस इक्वल टू माइनस 
gamma square minus omega square l c kittu. So, omega gamma note is equal to ingenium j omega root of l c. So, this forms the equation number 8. Then, we will current in the value and voltage in the value and calculate the value. So, our current value and voltage value in the characteristic impedance calculate. Characteristic impedance in the variable z is equal to v by i and v in the area i in the value area. So, the random equity So, characteristic impedance z not is equal to root of l by c. And then, it will be characteristic impedance in that term. Like, one gamma note will multiply the equation. Gamma note into z note is equal to gamma note in the value of the j omega root lc into z note in the value of the into root lc, root l by c. Solve it, cancel it. So, you will be getting as j omega l. So, gamma note is z note in the value of j omega l. Now, Equation number 7 is gamma square v is equal to minus v gamma square lc minus gamma i j omega l. Now, we will do this equation. j omega l in the variable gamma note z note. Same way, minus omega square lc in the variable gamma note square. So, these two values are equation number 7 is substituted. Replace here. Here is minus omega square lc and minus omega square lc is gamma node square. Here is j omega l here. So, that is omega node z node. Omega l is gamma node z node. Substitute m you will be getting as gamma square v is equal to gamma node square v minus gamma node z node gamma i. This is v calculate here. Equate here, V is equal to minus gamma gamma node z node divided by gamma square minus gamma node square into I. This form the equation number 11. Now, we have the electric field. Anna. Electric field and the gradient of V anna. that is equal to minus dou V by dou z. Dou by dou z and then we have the minus gamma. Anna. So, if you minus anna, minus minus positive plus I. So, gamma into V. Therefore, axial electric field is, can be written as E1 is equal to or EZ is equal to gamma into V curve value calculated. That V in the value, we substitute here. That is minus sign. Gamma square, gamma node into EZ node divided by gamma square minus gamma node square into I. So, this forms the circuit equation. You can have circuit equation number I because using this circuit equation, we can calculate the axial electric field of slow wave helix. Uh, your axial field is generated in electron beam current. Manner. 